Hi everyone, today we are giving you a tour of MyUVM, an individualized web page that gathers together information and links to information for students. To access your MyUVM page, Google MyUVM and click on the first page. Click on Login MyUVM and you will be led to a duo prompt. Follow the instructions to access your student page. Upon logging in, students are presented with the following page structure. As you can see, it is sorted into different pages for various information and resources. These pages or cards can also be customized. We will show you how to do that. The Brightspace page can be used to access Brightspace, which is used by your professors for all your classes. The email page connects you directly to your UVM Outlook email. The Student Financial Services page shows tuition and billing information such as account balances and histories. The Financial Aid page is where you will find all the information about your aid offer, awards, loans, and award history. The Tax Information card has the information about your 1098-T form. In the Change or Declare Major panel, you can see options for your college or school and can apply to other colleges or majors as well. The My Courses card shows classes you can add, course search, the link to manage your courses, and registration for a different term, among other things. In the Personal Information card, a student can update their directory information, address, emergency contacts, or access the change legal name form. The Academic Records panel can be used to look at your program information, grades, and transcript, among other things. Other default cards include the campus map, find a job, web links, and more. Now we'll show you some ways that you can customize your MyUVM page to make it easier to navigate based on personal preferences. If you click on the main menu over here on the left side and go to Discover, a bunch of other card options will show up. Or you can scroll all the way down and click on Discover More. You can also use the search bar to find specific pages you're looking to add. Some more fun cards include the one for your college, like Cass here, the New York Times card, and the career success card. Some important ones to add are the advisors panel to see your advisors and their contact information, the Ask a Librarian card provides students with resources for conducting research and also provides access to librarians, as well as information on, on, on other available services. The Degree Works page allows you to run your degree audit, which is basically how you can track your journey to complete your degree. And the Registrar page offers students access to their academic records and can be used for items such as course registration, final grade viewing, and enrollment verifications. You can add important cards to your homepage for easy access. There is no limit to how many cards you can bookmark. For example, let's look at the class schedule card. This is an important card to have on your homepage, so we'll add that. I'll find the card, then I'll click on the bookmark icon. And now when I go back to my homepage, we can see that our schedule card is here and done. Pages can be dragged around like so, and you can keep the important ones at the top. We hope this video was helpful and aided you as a new student. Thanks for watching.